I don't need that over here. Hello guys, I'm listening to you today. I'm going to do a drama life challenge. So, starting up first. I was born in a short place called Pakistan. So, I was born in Pakistan. So, in 2006, in Karachi, so, after, so, when I was born, first, there was a lot of names that my family met. To name me. Um, my mom named me. I think I don't know if she or something, or she or something. So it starts with the R, but then my grandpa said that he wanted to make me a seer. So then I got named. Then I got named a seer. And then the end of the name. And the name was Basir Pirzada. So it's Basir Pirzada. So, now I was born in 2009. In 2009, we applied for Canada. So, after all that, in after two years, in two thousand and eleven, there was my little baby brother. And he was actually so cute. And everyone was thinking name, but somehow it came up with Basil. So it's now Basil Rizada. So after all that, After all that, in, uh, in 2014, in, wait, what, in, in July, in July, two, zero, one, four, in 2014, July, 2014, no, actually 27 July 2014. It was the time. It was the time for us to leave Pakistan. And it was a night when we got dropped up into the when we got dropped up into the airport in the little in a little plane and when I saw the plane it was absolutely massive. God I was scared to go there. But somehow we got in there. So in this plane we spend like 14 hours to go into Canada because Pakistan when you when you are in Pakistan you're going to and you're going to 
Canada. It takes fourteen hours to go into Canada. So, when I got to Canada, first of all, there was like so many people happy standing there. There was a lot. There was like so many people that I can't even imagine. Um, it was two families. It was one in my mom's family and my dad's family were there to, to pick us up. But we were confused. Which home do we go? In my mom's sister's house or my dad's sister's house? We were confused. But finally we came up with a idea that we are gonna go that we are gonna go into my dad's family. So when we got there it was so new and uh, first time we saw like the basement of the house we went downstairs and it was pretty nice there I saw heavy bikes that I never saw in my country Pakistan so and then after that my dad took the driving test that we never take in Pakistan. We never take it in Pakistan. They just drive. They don't care. So they just drive the car in Pakistan. And first, my dad lost in the driving test. But then after, and then after. It was good. He didn't fail. He didn't fail that time. No, he now failed that time. He was good. So, then after a few days, we went to our mom, my mom's. Sisters I'm just writing it. So, sisters home and in the back today I saw a lot of cousins of me, my own cousin that I never saw in my entire life, some new cousins that I never saw in my life. But then finally I got to know them. And then they got to know me. And it was a happy day. It was pretty nice. And then, in July 2015, no more 2014, it wasn't, no more 2014, it was lost. So, in July 2015, 
I can tell the day, but I don't know it. I can't tell it to you guys. My cousin came. That was really not naughty. Oh, I forgot. When I was in my country, Pakistan, in Pakistan, I created a channel in daily motion and all that stuff so when i got to canada it was a new community to me in school everyone talks to me in my language of course so it was like a best wife and i got a straight when i was in Pakistan, i got to grade two but then i skipped grade two for only like three months and then I got to grade three in Canada. In Canada. Then then we never came back to Pakistan but then in July in July one, 2015, I remember, I started to create a YouTube channel. And then in my school, I got to grade 4. I got to grade 4. And they started to make their channels too. And they watched mine, then somehow, I got, I got in with like seven subscribers. Uh, I didn't even know that I was away for a long time. So after that, I just and right now, right now in I think uh, December twelve. Yeah, I think that December 12th, my cousin, he just got a coin, a little coin, stuck in his mouth. And I know it was really painful. And he was only one year old. It was only one year old. One. Imagine that. Imagine. So, now he's in the hospital. He is good. Everyone is okay now. So, he's absolutely okay. I'm gonna miss him. He did. He, when he was in Canada, he was safe, but then he went to Dubai, and then after that, he was about to go in Pakistan, but he didn't go. Because he got stuck, he's in Dubai right now. I don't know which time it is, and such. Oh. No, I don't want to search. It is right now. It is six over there in the night, and they are still in the hospital. I know I'm connected with them right now, so guys, I hope you enjoy and subscribe. That was my whole story, and I was like. A fat guy when I was little. So please, bye! I hope you enjoyed, guys. And if you enjoyed the video, so you need, I need your help to keep running this channel. I don't know 
how many things, but I love to do this, guys. This is my business.